Ready or not, here I come. Hi, <laughs> I'm Pogo, and I'm a poison dart frog. I'm here to tell you, friends, what you see isn't always what you get. <laughs> I look harmless, like a little tiny colorful creature. I don't have sharp mm. claws, a stinger, or fangs, but watch out. I'm one of the most powerful and deadliest animals on the planet. But I don't want to hurt you. I want to be your buddy. You and me, we're cool. <laughs> as long as you don't try to eat me. We poison dart frogs come in a bunch of different colors, including yellow, gold, copper, red, green, blue, or black. God gave us bright colors to warn other animals not to eat us. <laughs> we are not a healthy snack. We have aposomatic coloration. That's a fancy way to say that our colors scare off potential predators. My colors are like a sticker that says, yuck, do not eat. <laughs> yep, most of the time these bright colors do the trick. God's super cool design for me keeps me safe and alive. <laughs> Thanks, God. God helps people too, including you. In fact, before he went back to heaven, God's son, Jesus, promised to send a helper for his friends. Jesus said that when the helper came, his friends would be ready to tell people everywhere about Jesus and God's love for the whole world. Then, just like that, Jesus went away on a cloud. <laughs> Whoa! His mission on earth was complete and it was time to return to his father, God. It looked like Jesus had left his friends on their own. But remember, what you see isn't always what you get. Jesus wasn't leaving them alone at all. The helper was coming. And that helper is the Holy Spirit. You can't see the Holy Spirit, but the Holy Spirit is powerful. Even more powerful than a poison dart frog. It's tough to fully understand, but God is three in one. That's called the Trinity. God the Father, God the Son, that's Jesus, and God the Holy Spirit. Jesus, the Son, went back to heaven, but he promised that God, the Holy Spirit, would be there soon. That was a good thing because the Holy Spirit helps people. In the book of Galatians, chapter 5, verses 22 and 23, it says, But the Holy Spirit produces this kind of fruit in our lives. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. The Holy Spirit helps you lovingly and joyfully tell others about Jesus. The Holy Spirit will help you tell your family about Jesus and people in your town about Jesus and people who are far away. The Holy Spirit helps you tell everyone about Jesus. The Holy Spirit helped Jesus' friends in the Bible and the Holy Spirit still helps Jesus' friends today. The Holy Spirit helps us. That's good. I'm really glad that God helps me stay safe and sound. And I'm glad you don't think I'm yucky. <laughs> Let's be friends. <laughs> I promise to stay off your pizza. Ha! <laughs> Pogo pizza! Ooh, gross! <laughs> Bye!